So what you just heard was originally an improvised solo on the trumpet by Miles Davis, um, fairly famous jazz trumpet performer. Uh, if you don't know, check him out. Worth a listen. It was originally recorded for a session in 1954, later an album came out, Miles Davis Quartet, was originally on a 10-inch um, LP, was subsequently re-released on other, on other albums, other compilations, he played a lot extensively throughout his career, it's often a lot faster than that. So, as I mentioned, it was improvised, it wasn't just him playing, he had a, um, a quartet he was a part of a quartet and a trio behind him of um, Horace Silver playing piano, Percy Heath playing bass, and Art Blakey on drums. Fairly standard. Uh, Miles rarely played just his trumpet himself. But, uh, yeah. So, as a context for this, uh, or lack of context, <laughs> That was improvised over the piece four, but unless you're familiar with the melody, with the piece itself, transcribed solos often sound um, just without, well, without context. They often sound kind of abstract, like some sort of 20th century serialist type of piece of music. So what I would like to do for you, now that I've robbed you of your experience of hearing that solo in context, I'd like to add in some context. We're going to put the melody in front of it, restore everything that we have there, the melody, the harmony, with my friend and colleague, Dan Finn, helping me out on piano. And I will play the exact same solo, just this time, we kind of know where it's coming from. And my papers are all a little bit of a safety net for me. Mm -hmm. 